Hello everyone, welcome again to my role play. Today we will see one scenario which happening in emergency department. You are the nurse talking to a father of a two year old girl who has come to the emergency department because she was done by a bee a few hours ago. The parent and the child in triage. You have just examined the child. So I hope you have understood. Um, the emergency department scenario you have to here you have to just keep on keep concentration on uh, the last sentence you have just examined the child that means no need of introduction here just you can start with the um, I mean uh, uh, start with the uh, role play task that means after the examination how you are going to talk with the father so during the three minute preparation time you have to ask the baby's um, name and father name uh, it's not mandatory to ask baby's name but you have to ask father name and you can start with the task directly so let us see how is the uh, role play goes on well, Mr. Thompson, upon my examination on your baby's arm, I could confirm that this is nothing but bee sting. She got injured with the bee sting. So, nothing is there to be worried. Uh, you can see that this is a peculiar signs and symptoms of reddened and swelled area on that affected part. Oh, really, sister? Is there anything to get worried? Absolutely nothing, uh, Mr. Thompson. Um, nothing is there to be worried. Even uh, this is not multiple sting. You can see only in one part, isn't it? There is no other sting on her uh, body parts. Before proceeding further, I would like to ask you something regarding her uh, any other signs and symptoms. Whether she had uh, itching, um, hives, fever, or nausea, vomiting or any breathing problem uh, before coming to hospital? Hmm. She had itching at the moment over the area and slight fever. Other than that, nothing. Uh, well, it's fine. Only she had itching and uh, slight fever, isn't it? And what about the treatment? Whether have you given any uh, medication to her like emollient creams over the area or any pain relief medication or something like that? Yes, I washed her leg several times with soapy water and applied emollient cream. For fever, I gave her paracetamol syrup. Really, I am appreciating your action, what you did for your baby at um, home. So, you did the correct action. Uh, well, another one more question I would like to ask you regarding your baby. Whether she have any food uh, allergy or any other allergies to medicines or any previous history of insect bites? No, sister. She doesn't have any allergies. It's good to hear that she doesn't have any allergies. Uh, Mr. Thompson, so now I would like to inform you regarding the treatment, what we are planning to give her. Uh, first of all, uh, the concerned physician will examine your baby and he will start the antihistamines, that means the medications to reduce the swelling and for further symptoms. And uh, we are going to apply uh, some smoothening uh, cream over the area. Uh, and we will keep her under for monitoring maybe until um, 12 to 24 hours. Is it okay for you? I can understand your concern now Mr. Thompson as a father how you may feel now but nothing is there to your read and your baby is in safe hands in our hospital. Um, as I told you before, this is mandatory that we have to assess her or monitor her for at least 12 hours because um, actually there is no need for hospital admission if everything is goes fine. And uh, for your information, I would like to tell you that if, um, the, if she develop any severe allergic reaction or breathlessness or something like that, she may need admission. Other than that, nothing is there to be worried until now. I am reassuring that uh, she will get uh, discharged very soon. Just we will wait for her swelling to be subsided. And if there is no other symptoms, uh, of course, the concerned physician will discharge her. So, you mean that nothing is there to be worried for the moment? Yes, Mr. Thompson, nothing is there to be worried because um, upon my examination, I could tell you that this is nothing, only a, a one small, I mean, in one area, one particular area, there is basting and that particular area got swollen and redden. So, we will give the antihistamines so by that um, medicine. I hope everything will be all right. Do you have any other concern, Mr. Thompson, to be clarified? Okay, thank you for your concern and advices. 
are always welcome, Mr. Thompson. Uh, so I hope I have clarified all your doubts. Uh, please stay with your baby here. Let me check with the pediatrician. I will come back with him as early as possible. Meanwhile, if your baby have uh, any problem or if you want to seek any medical attention, you can press the buzzer here. I will be right there. Okay, thank you. I hope everyone enjoyed our role play. We will see in next role play. Until then, bye. Take care.